Look closely at this video taken by Bob Atkins as he walked his dog. You can see a black disc-like object whiz across the screen. And when it slowed down, the footage shows the strange shape that he claims may be a UFO. Pat Regan is the author of UFO, The Search for Truth. He's examined and blogged about this footage, and he joins me now via Skype. Hi there, Pat. How are you? Hey, fine, thank you. I'm trying to figure out, if you've seen this video, you've watched it over and over again, I'm sure. How strongly do you feel that this is an extraterrestrial sighting? It was one of those things that just caught my imagination. It just, I, I saw loads and loads of sightings while I was doing the book, because uh, in, in UFO, The Search for Truth, there are so many sightings. I've lost, lost count of them, actually. I also run something called um, Northwest U, UFO Research. Uh, people are always ringing me about UFOs, but this one was very intriguing, I thought. So I took some still in, images. I don't know. This is one of the still images. People have said to me, oh, it's probably a bird. It's probably a bug. Well, well, actually, it's the, the shape is is a it's a cylindrical shape. If anything, as you can see, it's almost like a bullet shape. That was as it came into the into the frame. As it went out of the frame, it's it's sort of that's the that's the other side of it there. And you, and you can see it's it, it certainly doesn't look like any bug that I've ever seen. And, and I know quite a bit about bugs because I'm a fly fisherman and I tend to tie my own trout flies, that type of thing, so I do know the uh, the entomology of things, and I've not, never seen anything quite like that myself, it was very intriguing. What about the speed of this this object? It was, you know, very quickly you saw it in the right, four slides Absol later it was on the left? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we've, we've also got the whole story up on um, a website now, where I run a forum called supernaturalufo.com, which is a really good website, and it's not my website, but I, I write on it. and. We, we did notice a lot of people have said it does seem to be moving at incredible speed this thing and people have also pointed out that there seems to be something in the background that whizzes around quickly so it could be the same object or something different in the distance we don't know but if so then it's traveling at pretty phenomenal speed as you mentioned you're pretty up on those ufo sightings that are going on in that area have there been more recent sightings like this one uh, not quite like this one. I'm dealing with one today, actually, which is from another area called Sea Scale, which is um, a, an interesting area. They all seem to be stemming, or not all of them, but most of them seem to stem from the western coast of um, the coastal area of Cumbria, the Lake District, which I find quite interesting. We often find that there's a there seems to be a relationship between water and UFOs, and I'm not the first researcher to have mentioned this.